you guys. What's the name of the bear in the Jungle Book? Baloo. Baloo. See, everybody's calling him Baloo. Let me count the ways we will spend our days living our lives in the U.S.C. Abajo. We're in America now. How about you? See, don't let it get you down. How about you? See, how about wow? Hey everyone, and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, I'm Josie and I'm from Leipzig, Germany, but I've been living in Los Angeles for the last seven years, and you should probably subscribe. Let me tell you, one of the first things I noticed when moving to LA was that the cost of living is ridiculous. Everett, we need to talk. Everett, sit down. How about Josie? Sit down. We need to do something about this. You need to get a job. Gross! Why do you always resort to prostitution? It's easy money, baby. Why can't you have an adult conversation with me? Why can't you have an adult conversation with me? I am having an adult conversation with you. Well then what are you complaining about? We're out of money. We need income. Doing that. Well, what do you suggest that I do? It's not about you, it's about us. I mean, I like what you're doing with the YouTube channel, but it's just not paying the bills. I know, right? Who would have thought it'd be so hard to make money off of YouTube? Let's just look at expenses. I mean, just look at how much we're paying for the car. So you want to get rid of the car now? No, I don't know. It's just, I really wish we hadn't gotten a new one right before the apocalypse. Yeah, well, whose fault was that for wrecking the fully paid car we had before? Um, yours for getting one with massage seats. You know you wanna come out and take the tram in Deutschland. Clearly we can't get rid of the car. And clearly we can't get rid of me. Josie? I can see you're calculating, Josie. That's your math face. Ah, but Josie, you can't really be considering getting rid of me. You are kind of expensive to maintain. And you do make me laugh. <gasps> Ow, oh. <sighs> Worth every penny. <sighs> My American and I live in mid-city Los Angeles, and you could probably buy a house here for like $700,000, or get a two-bedroom apartment for $2,000 a month. But if you walk up the same street just a few minutes, you'll run into houses that cost at least one and a half million dollars, or like a two bedroom for 5,000 a month. Shoot, in Beverly Hills, I was leasing two bedrooms for $10,000. What, who would even pay that? At that point, you might as well just get a house. You'd be surprised. Sure, it would be nice to live here instead of the ghetto. Oh, come on. We don't live in the ghetto. It's not like we live in Compton. Our apartment looks like it's from the 80s, and half of our neighbors don't even speak English. Think of it more as an upscale ghetto. Oh, so because we have fireworks instead of gunshots every night, we're too posh to be called the ghetto. If you hate where we live so much, why don't we just move out here? Are you joking? We can't even afford where we live right now. Yeah, but we're out here all the time. Because of the Pokemon. I can't believe you still play that game. God, you're such a nerd. Whatever, you've been playing Transformers for like four years. Yeah, well... The point is, we wouldn't be able to afford to live here even if we had a roommate. Wait, that just gave me an idea. Edible casino chips? What? No. Why do they even call them chips if you can't eat them? You know the spare room that we have? The one with the Zool monster? Zool. 
Anyway, I was thinking we should rent it out. You want to get a roommate? Yeah, why not? Because then I won't be able to walk around naked anymore. So it's a great idea. Uh, but Josie, we'll be letting somebody into our personal lives. We're getting a roommate, not a bedmate. How much would you charge for a bedmate? We're not getting a bedmate. 500? No. 1,000? Everett. 2,000? Hmm. Aha! It would have to be another guy. What? I'm not sharing my bed with another dude. Men are gross. Hmm, no argument here. Okay, fine. How do you suggest we get another roommate? Hold auditions? So, um, yeah, my name's Natalie. I am an actress. I've, you know, done a few plays, short films, TV stuff. I work for Uber on the side. I can hear an accent. Where are you from? Oh, I'm from Germany. No way. I'm from Germany. Ich habe mich schon gewundert, warum du einen Weihnachtskalender hinter dir hast. Oh, ja, äh, geht nicht ohne, oder? Ja, aber die sind ja voll schwer zu finden in Amerika. Oder Adventsgrenze. Also wenn ich einen haben wollen würde, müsste ich mir den selber basteln. Da bin ich ganz schlecht drin. Das stimmt, ja. Adventsgrenze muss man selber basteln, sonst hat man echt Pech. Das gibt's hier gar nicht. Die wissen nicht mal, was Glühwein ist? Ja, Amerikaner haben ja auch überhaupt keine Weihnachtstradition. Scheiß, Scheiß Amerikaner. Amerikaner. So, what part of Germany are you from? Oh, I'm from Bavaria. Oh, so you're not a real German. Everett, we talked about this. What? You're the one who told me that Bavarians aren't real Germans. That they're way down south, that they talk funny, they don't eat real sausages, and that nobody in Germany likes them. Yeah, but you're not supposed to say that in front of a Bavarian. You know I can hear you guys, right? See? She heard you. You guys love football, right? I love football, but not that American crap, okay? I mean, the real stuff. You know, the kind of you don't need cheerleaders to keep people's attention, where you stop every 30 seconds because the players need a break and advertisers need to make more money. 90 minutes of pure action, okay? Now, here's the thing. America actually has good players now. You've got Christian Pulisic at Chelsea. Juventus has Weston McKinney, all right? Josh Sargent plays at Werder Bremen. John Brooks over in Wolfsburg. Chris Richards plays for Bayern. Come on. We've got really good players, Sergio Dest and Conrad de la Fuente, playing for Barcelona. I'm telling you, America is going to get even further in Qatar 2022 than they ever have. At least quarterfinals. We're already champions of the World Cup. What? The Women's Cup is way better than the Men's Cup. Never in my life have I felt the urge to slap someone more than I do now. Is that weird? No, it's normal. If you want, I can slap him for you. Oh, no, actually, I'm kind of against, but... You're welcome. That looked, uh, satisfying, actually. I like this one. Tell me more about football. Oh, yeah, look, America. God, let me get started on the players. Zach Steffen, our goalkeeper, plays for Manchester City. Like I said, John Brooks at Wolfsburg, Serginho Dest at Barcelona, Weston McKennie at Juventus, Gio Reyna at Borussia Dortmund, Chris Richards at Bayern, Josh Sargent at Werder Bremen, and Tyler Adams. Yeah, he plays for RB Leipzig. Yeah, but nobody likes Red Bull, Leipzig, Rossenball, or whatever they call it. You might as well be owned by Audi and call yourself Bayern 2. De donde eres? Oh, de Argentina. Hablas español. Bueno, mis padres son de Puerto Rico. Ah, eres de Puerto Rico. Bueno, como sabrás, acá en Los Ángeles hay mucha gente de Puerto Rico, de República Dominicana, países latinoamericanos. Eh, con mis rumes anteriores estuvimos cocinando bastantes comidas de Colombia, de Venezuela, arepas. Así que si quieren, chicos, puedo cocinar para ustedes. Y quería agradecerles por eh, esta entrevista y por tenerme en cuenta para, para poder vivir con ustedes. Ah, sin carajo. What? Oh. I'm sorry, I actually was just reminded of my father. He used to say as en carajo to the TV all the time. Oh, okay. I was, you know, just saying that I can cook really well and you're going to enjoy my dishes. Are you going to be like mi abuela? Whenever I didn't want to eat her food, she would just bang cabinets and yell, Pues, come mierda! Um, I don't think so. <laughs> ah, bueno, no te preocupes, mi amor. Todo bien. Okay, this needs to stop. I don't know what you're saying and I can't have a roommate and a husband conspire against me behind my back in a secret language. Pero Josie, mira que linda es ella. 
She's beautiful. <gasps> what do you think about bedmates? <laughs> Aren't you a lawyer? Yes, and as a lawyer, I suggest you take me in as your roommate. I won't even charge you for this consultation. Can you get me more Vicodin? Blah! I see why you need it. Hi, hi. <laughs> hi, I'm Malou. Perfect. When can you move in? What? We haven't even asked her anything yet. Why even bother? It always ends up with me in pain anyway. Okay, Malou, tell us about yourself. I'm an actress living in LA. I'm originally from Brazil. Um, I now work at an acting school and I teach at the acting school with little kids. Uh, I love musicals. I love dogs. Like Disney musicals? Uh, yes, I love Disney musicals. Have you seen Frozen the musical? Yeah, it's the best. Yes, it's so good. Wait, have you seen Hamilton? Have I seen Hamilton? Is the sky blue? Cause no one else was in the room where it happened, the room where it happened, happened, the room where it happened. happened. No one knows how the game is played, how the sausage is made, and the room where I'm bad with lyrics, but I love it. I will never be satisfied, satisfied, satisfied. Oh, I'm sorry about that. You get used to it. Okay. To make things work in Los Angeles, you have to make sacrifices. Or, in our case, additions. Which is why so many people here have roommates. It's just too expensive to live on your own. But during the quarantine, it actually works out really well to have somebody home who shares your boredom. And it works out even better when you have a roommate that you get along with. And we love our new roommate, Malou. Right, Malou? Yes, and Malou loves you too. Mwah. Man, those Brazilians are huggers. Baba Josie. In America now, how about Josie? Don't let it get you down. How about Josie? I'll always be around. How about Josie? How about Hmm. He looks crazy cool. There's an episode wrap on Malou and on me, but not you. What? What do I have to do? The Zool monster. Oh man! If you're new here, I'm German. I'm Germany, and I'm from. <laughs> Why do you always resort to prostitution? <laughs> I think Natalie has to leave. I know. <laughs> I know. I'm leaving. This is a closed set. Oh, I looked at the camera. <laughs> well, then what do you suggest? That <laughs> You've got this little grin that I can't like. It's your like ugly face when you think about prostitution. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to like get over. One and a half million dollars or a two bedroom apartment for five thousand a month. It's not a five bedroom apartment, guys. <laughs> <laughs> that would be so much space. Yeah, I know. This is like all leasing. stupid yeah. leasing talk, yeah. and that's boring. I love you too, Josie. That's when I come in, right? Yeah, now. are you practicing? No, <laughs> you're gonna come in at the, uh, the next one. Probably buy a house here for like seven hundred thousand a month. Oh. 700,000 a month? It's a good price. And this is the last one, guys. Swear. Pinky swear. You'll find houses that have at least sh that have at least Now I have to cut off my pinky because I pinky swore myself. Oh no, oh, no that's how it works? Yeah, yeah, you have to cut off your pinky if you break your pinky promise. What the crap? Yes. This is insane. Wake up some of these brain cells. It's insane, insane. Go in the background, go in the background, go in the background. Well, us, take one. Okay. No neck ever. How's it going, guys? It's kind of scary how much you just look like that crazy alien dude. <laughs>
Okay. For the, for the new man in black, if you're not casting him, you're missing out. Good. Well, but you're right about one thing. Just can you stop having a weird face? I need to. I can't help it when I'm looking okay, at myself. Your eyebrows need to be a little more arched. They shouldn't be so much down. Be calm. 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 So, your name is Natalie. It sounds like I'm slating. <laughs> Hi, I'm Natalie. And I'm Hi, I'm Natalie. I'm auditioning for the part of roommate. Please cast me. I haven't worked in over a year due to the pandemic. Thank you. Ja, aber die sind ja total schwer zu finden in Deutschland. Äh. Ja, das kann ich vielleicht schon versuchen. Oh my god, I'm no, sorry. No, no, it's so bad. It's so bad. I'm surprised it came out right. Can we try with one? No. Can't do that. I'll embarrass myself in front of your entire German community. Okay. I can't. We have exactly that spot. Oh no! You said <laughs> no. I forgot the camera was rolling. Yeah, I mean, I okay, one more time. Okay. All right. <laughs> Giant forehead. Yeah, you have a five head. A what? It's not a forehead. It's a five head. 